Hey everybody, it is May 15th. I'm Adam and this is your daily dose of today. Never done one of these before in the airport in between flights, so we'll give it a shot. Um, it's not easy with all the distraction and the noise behind me. But today I want to speak about having the proper mindset for success. And, you know, if we think about this in like terms of sports, um, before you start a game, if you, your whole team thinks you're going to lose, and you're probably going to lose. You still might win, but you're probably going to lose. And But if you have the right attitude uh, and you believe you can win, you truly believe you can win, and you have the attitude of a winner, then when things are close, or even if you're down by some points, you still have the resolve that you can win. And you can still um, keep pushing to try and overcome whatever the obstacles are that are in your path. But it goes before that. You can't just dial it in or, t- or tune it on um, uh, whenever it's game time. Right? If you're going to be successful, you have to carry that mindset with you throughout the day. Do you think you know, it will take you know, Steph Curry, the way he stepped up with Kevin Durant out in the playoffs right now, do you think that, that he... It's like, oh man, we're going to lose. And then right before the game, he gets himself psyched up. He's like, I can do this. I can do this. No. He knew full well he could step up into that role, and he's done it. As a matter of fact, I bet you he went to bed the night before believing that they were going to win. And I, I'm a firm believer that setting the right attitude, setting the right demeanor, isn't something you wake up with. It's something you go to bed with. And at the end of the day, at the end of your day, even if you had a tough day, you need to reset your mind. Even if here's a day of like not the success you wanted, and maybe it's a day of setbacks and some failures, you got to reset your mind. You've got to reframe that before you go to bed. Because if not, you're letting all that sink into your subconscious at night while you're sleeping. I failed. I didn't succeed. I had all these problems. This didn't go my way. These people are out to get me. And guess what? You wake up. That, that racks on you all night. You need to process that before you go to bed. Now, a lot can be said to sleeping on things and not letting your anger get on them. But you have to have that mindset that that's what you're going to do. And you have to start reframing. So, for instance, if you have a bad day, some things really didn't go your way, you might not be able to completely get over it before you go to bed. But if you start that reframing process, like, man, this really sucks, and I really hurt right now, I'm really angry right now, but I know that there's an opportunity in here, and I just have to find it. And just start putting that in your mind when you go to bed. And that will begin to work. Your brain will begin to work. And see if you don't feel a lot better in the morning. Seeking an answer when you go to sleep. Spend your time going to sleep trying to seek the positive, seek the answer. And see if that doesn't help you reframe for the morning. And that you can find the answer out of that, what the opportunity was uh, in that failure or that setback. Well, I'm going to keep it short today. But keep that successful frame of mind in there. Because remember, uh, success is born out of failure just like I shared a second ago. You can do it. I did it. You can do it too. So, what are you going to do about it today? Start where you are. Get that positive mindset. This has been your daily dose of today.